It is your Brian Report right here on the People Station V103, and it's been brought to you by Kia. Hurry in during Kia's summer SUV clearance event. Visit KiaDealers.com to learn more. All right. Um, mm. Kevin Hart yes. was being extorted. Mm. Oh, my God. Uh, a video that TMZ broke about uh, some alleged infidelity. Mm-hmm. You know, um, they're saying the audio was from... You know, different clips of Kevin talking about his life and how he would never, you know, cheat on his wife. And, and so this person said all these things happened at the Cosmopolitan Hotel mm-hmm. in Las Vegas. Right. While his uh, wife was at home. I mm-hmm. guess it was her birthday weekend. Mm-hmm. And she was pregnant or whatever. And he right. was in Vegas. And, and so Kevin has to uh, go to his social media and all those millions and millions of followers. And he says this. Um, I'm at a place in my life where I feel like I have a target on my back. And because of that, I should make smart decisions. And recently, I didn't. Um, you know, I'm not perfect. I'm not going to sit up here and say that I am or, or claim to be in any way, shape, or form. And I made a bad error in judgment and put myself in an environment where only bad things can happen, and they did. And in doing that, I know that I'm going to hurt the people closest to me, who I've talked to and apologized to, being my wife and my kids. Um, and I just, you know, it's, it's a leadership moment. It's a leadership moment when you, when you know you're wrong and there's no excuses for your wrong behavior. Um, at the end of the day, man, I just simply got to do better. But I'm not going to also allow a person to to have financial gain off of my mistakes. And in this particular situation, that's what was attempted. I said I'd rather fess up to my mistakes. Financial gain? I, I just think that as a woman, I, I'm not trying to hear that right now because his wife is pregnant. Mm-hmm. And in that time of being pregnant, you're emotional. You cry a lot. You, you know, you got a new baby on the way. Like, I just, I, I'm just not feeling it. And how many, how many times are we going to excuse this right. from him? That's the thing. Like, this is the second woman now who who's, he's kind of put out there to look dumb. And the one thing that women oh, hate, that women don't hate nothing more than being put out there to look stupid. That's the first thing. But the second thing that sticks out to me, though, there's a difference between a mistake and a bad decision. Right. This is not... Infidelity is not a mistake it's because a you mistake. know exactly what you're doing. It's not a mistake. It's a bad decision. Well, unless you're on drugs and you that's a mistake. That's a, it's bad, a bad decision. bad decision to take the drugs then. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Is. Like this is And it is. This is a bad decision. You have to say, look, I made a bad decision. Yeah. I knew what I was doing. Well, you know, in the video on TMZ, wow. it, and it's not it, it's just like a, almost like how Star Wars begins. It's just yeah. it's just text. Yeah. You know, uh the person who made this <sighs> is saying Basically, that the weekend was filled with just Kevin just having sex with all these different people right. and that he was, you know, under the influence of some type of narcotic. Oh but God. they also say, and this is the part that got me, was like they were saying, like, it was easy hmm. to mm. tape him. Mm. Mm. Like he was so into whatever was going on. Mm-hmm. It wasn't like they had to sneak and do it. Where right. were his boys at? Oh, the plastic couple? Where, where's your boy supposed to have your back? You know what I'm saying? To tell you it, not it, to make those decisions, right? I know Kevin Hart's in town. I think this is a scenario. Kevin probably needs to come and really be humble and like on a live format like this show and, and really address this because these women... Women ain't trying to hear trying that. Trying to hear that. We're not trying to hear that right now. Like, we're not. You you know what you were doing when you were in a right state of mind when you decided to do all of this. Like, come on. Yeah. And, and none of us are perfect. Yeah. But... Your wife is pregnant. Come right. on, dude. It's her birthday. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wendy Williams is back today, right? Yep. You know, she was on the show not too long ago. Uh, those bikini pictures surfaced. She said she didn't know there was any paparazzi around. Everybody's talking about... Wendy said she didn't want to be big in the back and big in the front. She can go out and get a, a fake booty like everybody else, but that ain't what she want to do. She's 52 years old. As long as her man like it, when she get in the bed next to him, everything is all good. T.I. puts up a, a post and says, you know, I, I could go... And fight that ass up, but I won't. Yeah. (laughs) Wendy says, wait a minute, Tip. I'll address this. But she also says it's the people.com. No, his wife is going to be on the show on Friday. (laughs) If they're still married, I have no idea. I I heard he wears lips. Uh, No, no. I'm grown. This is not about T.I. This is about Tiny and her group escape. You know when a short man puts lips in his shoes to be a little taller. Maybe I should wear butt pads to give me some more ass. (laughs) Oh, wow. Today, I'm sure the hot topics oh will be God. lit. Yeah. That oh is God. your brand report. Right Ooh. here on the People Station V103. They blowing me up about Kev. I'm telling you, the women are hot. Boy, they mad this morning. And if you don't know, now you know. You know, you know, you know. The Ryan Report. The Ryan Report. V103.